Let's see how much this incendiary damage does. You guys are backing away. You're like, what the hell is she doing? Why is she getting so close? What the hell is about to happen? Boom. Eh, how about on the initial? Never mind. They're both a pile of ash. To the back door and welcome back to borderlands what's possibly gonna be the final episode uh we need to turn that down so that's loud but uh yeah i am two three levels over the maximum that we're gonna end up being yeah we gotta find tannis possibly put an end to steel and Hopefully gain back the Volki. I don't believe Tannis is a traitor. I don't think she is. Pretty sure she's a, still a friend. Oh yeah, if you're wondering why Angel isn't popping in every so often, it's because she is uh, disabled. She can't really talk right. No? Echo Neck's down so she can't see us. She may still be talking to us. I can't remember. Uh, what? The hell? Right! Uh, I forget who the boss is. Now you will die! Thanks, Steel. What's gonna kill me? Really? That's the best you got? Some level 31 lance? Master McCloud! Hey, do you know a guy named, um... Oh, I was about to make a Back to the Future reference, but I'm simply blanking on... Marty McCloud? No, that's Marty McFly. McCloud, McCloud. I swear to God I've heard the name McCloud before. That's it. Some bit of reference. 3000 XP, not bad. Can you stop with the screaming? Thanks to the cannon. Wait, why did you have an Iridian cannon? Alright. Crimson Fastness. Wait, what? Fastness? Why the hell is it called Fastness? I don't remember it being called that. Maybe it's just been a long time. Only by the best, if the vault is real. Like I said, several levels over. Also, like I said before, the max level for normal mode is 31. Yes, I know there's a claptrap behind me. No, I'm not helping the little fucker. He can sit there and suffer and leak out for all I care. God, their screams of agony and d as they die are kind of annoying. And, and horrific, I guess I should say that part. Hey, you traitor! What are you up to? Here we go. Alright, artifacts. Or relic facts. Uh, find the command console. It's probably impossible to track to take back that vault key or open the vault now. Let's focus on something else instead. Let's bring the ecosystem back online. The lance locked it down, but I know where we can bring it back since I pretty much invented it. It. I didn't know that part. Wrote some instructions on the back of this paper towel. Please find the command console and follow my instructions. Gotcha. You guys really suck. Here we go. Take that. Uh, this appears to be the Echo Command Console that Tan described. If managed to read her scrambling scrawl, you should be able to reactivate the system. Come back to this. I keep wanting to set up little bits and bobs for thumbnails. It just makes my job a little bit easier later on. Come on. Big 
reveal. Yeah, bad. Oh, badass. Um, that's actually a bit of a problem. Let's go on this side where your turrets can't see me. They are a similar level to me, and that is actually kind of scary. Wish you're all badass. Why wouldn't you be? Hey, level up. You guys are even more screwed than you were before. You realize you guys throw- Mmm, what the fuck was that voice crack? You guys realize the more of you idiots you throw at me, the stronger you make me, right? I don't appreciate that. I find that shield beep noise extremely discomforting. I'd prefer if you stopped, would stop breaking my freaking shield, dude. I don't want to know where that goes. Off to Crimson Enclave. Achievement. Discover Crimson Lance Enclave. They really did use to give out achievements or just anything. What the hell is going on out there? I don't want to know. I, I don't even kind of want to know. You idiots are basically just anything I can throw at you. I wonder if Steel still thinks she's gonna win. I mean, at this point, I'm just gonna follow her to the freaking vault and kill her, take the key, and take whatever's inside. Is that legendary? Oh, I got the jewel treatment. It was freaking money over a green, which made it look like a legendary. I thought that was a world drop legendary. Oh, hey, finally. Or transfusion. Transfusions are really good in this game, but that's mainly because there's not many ways to heal. See, each mission I complete will bring me closer and closer to a level up, and that subsequent level up will make me more and more powerful than I was before, which is then going to make it harder for them to kill me and easier for me to kill them. What is that noise? Oh, just turns. I love how at this point turrets are like, yeah, whatever. You can take them or leave them. Mostly leave them. Leave them in shambles. Also, turrets drop shields. I don't know why. Hmm. Borderlands 1 had usable doors. Did any other Borderlands game had usable doors that weren't part of a mission? Huh. Never thought about that. Here we go. Weirdly enough, the gear in like chests and vendors is 28, but... More, oh no, 25. How the hell did I get a level 31 transfusion then? You know what, don't question the world drops, just take them. Take them, be happy, and don't complain. Otherwise, the uh, Borderlands gods will give you a good spanking. Oh. Crap, uh... From Scorpio Toad Skill. Oh, that's a world drop legendary. Legendary artifact, but legendary all the same. I thought I got one. What to ask gave me Ah, here we go. There we go. Nice. Let's see how much this incendiary damage does you guys are backing away you're like what the hell is she doing why is she getting so close what the hell is about to happen boom eh, how about on the initial never mind they're both a pile of ash i loved how they were backing away from me and they were just so fearful for their continued existence oh i love striking fear into the hearts of my enemies that's the second one done uh, don't bother about the laser shooting guardian. Just kill the guy with the rocket launcher. That is kind of dangerous. Okay, now focus on the guardians. Uh, 
The Guardians are actually gonna make him this dangerous. As well as you are. You could've lived. Oh. Sniper? Yeah, sniper. Can't tell what kind though. Actually, that it? No, that's out of bounds. Because that is the entrance, so that is definitely out of bounds. So let's not go jumping down there, shall we? And a one, and a one, and a. The fuck was that? Okay, walk that back. And a one, and a two, and a one, two, three, four. That's the echo net back on. And now we have to go back to Tannis. Nope. I hoped I could do that, but I couldn't. Oh, that hurts. 8,000. Hey, this actually plays seem really close. 8,000 bucks for that one. Oh, God. Dying's expensive. Hmm. Oh, yeah, I didn't leave the map, so loot doesn't despawn. Why did they ever think that was a good idea? Allowing loot to stay if you just leave the map and don't. Whatever. And here we go. I regret not trusting you, but we've no time for who betrayed whom. Steel has taken the key and is already on her way to the vault. Hey, for me, take the bitch down. Oh, I like this, Tannis. This is the Tannis I remember. One who loves a good bit of bloodshed. That was probably the closest to the Tannis we have now in days. The fuck did you four come from? Whoa. I can see you. G I can you see the hell I'm in the middle of? Listen, Wait, what? No time to waste. You must immediately reach the vault. Go now. Like a good That's surprise, right? Like putting your pocket, putting your hand in your pocket and finding a twenty-dollar bill, right? Like a good surprise. I'll assume a good surprise. Ah, the echo network is back up. I'm guessing we have you to thank for that. Mm -hmm. If you need anything at all, remember to use the commerce grid. I'm sure there's something helpful for you there, partner. Thanks for that, I think. I was half expecting freaking advertisements. Out of his ass. And surprising. There is no time left. You must reach the vault by any means necessary. We will not get another opportunity in this lifetime. Thanks for that. I kind of caught on already. <laughs> Yo, need to pick up the pace, need to be quick, I get it. Let's get out of here. Now who wants to go on a bunch of side quests and completely forget about the main No, I'm not gonna do that. Though I kinda want to. Though I already do that enough in like Skyrim and other games of that sort, so Yeah, let's let's just not. Hi you crimson fox. How you doing? Having a good day? Nice weather? It's getting a little chilly on Pandora, don't you agree? Probably getting close to winter around here, right? What would, what would the Pandoran version of Christmas be? And no, I don't mean Mark, Marcus's Marcus Day Christmas DLC thing. I mean, like, what would a genuine Borderlands Christmas be? Here we go. We're about to be diving into the Iridian areas. These are some of my favorite areas in this entire game. The Descent. No matter which of the Borderlands games it's been, I'd say that the Iridian areas, not including DLC packs the and stuff. The hourglass is on the last few grains of sand. You must reach the vault by any means necessary. We will not get another opportunity like this in your lifetime. Yeah, thanks for that. Or your lifetime. You're human as well. You know that, right? Ooh, Vault Center. God, I remember being here for the first time. It's so, so cool. Thanks for that. There goes all those feeders? Trash feeder? What the? 
Why are they level one? Whatever, don't really care that much. Gotta remember being here for the first time. So cool. But if we're on the last two grains of sand, as you put it, should you really be using metaphor then and just instead just getting straight to the point? You guys do not fare well. Sup, dude? How you doing? Can, uh, you back the fuck up? Right, fire damage doesn't do much to you. Oh, your shield's a bitch. If I can break the freaking shield, I'll be able to get to you pretty easily. Yeah, your shield's the only thing keeping you alive. Holy crap, 10,000. 10,000 XP! That's insane! Oh, oh, dude. Oh, I thought you were missing all your limbs. No. You just kind of, I think, shat yourself to death? Probably. Got it. I may level up before I get to the final boss. Oh, that's going to be a pain in the ass. Really hope I get a chance to buy some ammo. Got it. And a level up. I thought I would level up one more time if no I did that. Longer range. Quicker reload. Pistol prop maybe would do more damage, but this can do a bit more damage a bit quicker and reload quicker. It's gonna be a bit better against the guardians. You idiots, I just need to use my fire SMG that's like 12 levels under. I'm not joking. I think it's level 21 and we're level 35. Yeah, I think that's a bit more than 12 levels under. <laughs> oh, you poor saps. You didn't know what hit ya. Oh, death. That is death. Do not jump down there. Our next stop is Ceridium Paramounts. What? Oh, right. The gauntlet before the vault. Right, I remember this place. This is mostly Iridians. With a small bit of infighting. Love the freaking snow particles. I don't think the original one of these areas had snow particles like this. So I may be mistaken. guys because I phased walked over to him to use my explosion for some extra damage all the littler guardians abandoned the arc guardian to come fight these idiots and just left the arc guardian to my to my freaking mercy which isn't very plentiful if you can tell oh that's bullshit can shoot me through a pillar the hell you think you're doing god this is a big map you know it's hard to pass up fighting the guardians at the very least because it's like a uh, thousand something to twelve hundred something three thousand for the arc guys like it's a lot of XP per individual kill like a lot a lot of XP And also, this is partially why I stopped at level 31 and a half, I believe. 
when I was farming the Rakai, which that is what I farmed to get to this level and a bunch of this gear, if you're wondering. But um, that's why I stopped there, because I knew I'd be getting level ups from this, because I'd be just barely above levels, so I'd be risking getting way, 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 way too overpowered. Which normally is a good thing, but it does kind of take the fun out of a lot of it. Getting so overpowered that it's basically impossible for most anything to kill you. I say that, but... I mean, Jolts did... Son of a bitch. Never mind. No, my stupidity can still kill me. There we go. God, I gotta be there soon. It's ridiculous. Yeah, I'm loving the XP. I'm about to level up again, but for fuck's sakes, I don't need another level up. I need the freaking ending. This is it. The reason you're here. I've guided you to this point, and you've done so well. Know that you are ready for this. When the vault opens, brace yourself. I believe in you. You can do this. God. I remember hearing that for the first time, being like, wait, I thought the vault was loot. Love that. If you haven't got on yet, the vault isn't what it seems. Uh, I actually don't care about you guys. Because I'm fairly certain when I go in here, I'm going to complete the current mission. The vault. Here we go. I'm going to complete the current mission, which is going to give me more than enough XP to level up. Also, I want to kind of save a level up bonus. You have failed to listen to Commandant Steele. I've warned you time and again that uh -huh. you persist on ignoring my orders. Uh -huh. The contents of the vault are rightfully the property of the mm -hmm. Admiral Corporation. But you, <laughs> you belong to me. Didn't that must get, get dissolved like really quickly? This is probably one of the cooler vault summonings we've ever seen. Yeah, the key works. Sergeant, get your team ready to You know, go you're not in future games for a reason. Bye-bye. And the destroyer. Getting Don't give up. This creature may be immortal in its own realm, but in this reality, it cannot survive without a host, and that makes it vulnerable. When yep. it becomes flesh and blood, it can be hurt, even killed. You just need to know where to aim. Uh-huh. It's level 33. I'm level 36. I just got a level up bonus. Oh, you poor, poor sucker. You're... This is gonna be a painful death for you, and I feel... Absolutely no pity. Not as painful as I thought. Can you not do that? This is an oddly familiar situation. This is what happened the first time I killed the freaking destroyer several years ago. When I first played this freaking game, are you kidding me? It's the same freaking thing that happened last time. Uh, oh, that eye beam's actually kind of dangerous. Don't you do it, don't you do it. Um. It's actually a bit of a problem. Uh, crap. Ammo, ammo, give me... This is legitimately an issue. Crap. No. No, 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 no. I am not dying to a fucking enemy that is three levels under me. What? Are you kidding? I mean, you'd stay partially dead, which is fine, but seriously? This got to be a joke. Oh, hi. Why the hell does this keep happening? 
you're actually really strong now that I think about it. Like, even for being three levels under, you're extremely strong. I mean, Cover you're almost dead, but still. Come no on. Way. Just die already. Oh, come so on. Will you just freaking die. Holy crap, you have literally no health. It's... What? I don't want to kill it while I'm bleeding out. Just in case. Die already! Fuck's sakes! And off back to its dimension it goes to come back in a the vault. final game. I'm sorry I couldn't warn you about what was in it. But for you to be there to stop it, it couldn't have unfolded any other way. You did well, and your actions haven't gone unrewarded. The key won't open the vault for another 200 years, but I'm sure Tennis will pay you quite the fortune for it. Now go. I'll be watching. Oh, I know you will be. I still love the fact that that was revealed in, like, the first game. And yet that has such a big impact on the seconds. What? Thank God. Oh, crap. Right, they advertised the first DLC with that one. There we go. <sighs> that is awesome. I love that. What loot do we got? It's a normal mode should have raced mine, up. And mine. 24. Really? 24, 25? I'm level 36! Give me something a bit better than well, that. Lucky. Uh, I should say, now that I have completed the game, one, if it wasn't clear, yes, I already played this game years ago, I knew what was gonna happen, all that good stuff, um, but as well, now I'm going to be moving on to play, oh my fucking god, I'm going to be moving on to playing the DLC for each of the games, BL3, BL2, BL... God, I'm gonna the claptrap revolution. That's a fun one where you get to murder hundreds of thousands of those little fucking claptraps. But yeah, I'm gonna be doing that. I know there's the prequel which I have yet to play on my channel, but I don't own a copy of the prequel on any of my consoles at the time right now, and I really want to move into the DLC. The prequel has some fun DLC as well, but. All of it kind of falls... Right, you guys sort of scale. Wow, 1 XP. But the prequel's DLC just kind of completely falls outside of main storyline type of stuff, you know? I'll get to the prequel eventually, but... That's... I have the Volky, you sorry bitch. Also, a thank you would be... Kindly appreciated for having broken you out of jail. You know that? Thank you for bringing this to me. This cash sum should cover the hardship. Not even close. <laughs> You've endured and ensure you can your continued silence. The key won't work again for hundreds of years. That's one weird thing. Like, Lilith's in Borderlands 2. There's like two different things that they completely dropped. One, the fact... And this was from the prequel. The fact... No, this was from Borderlands 2, I believe. And maybe the prequel. The fact that there can only be three sirens in existence any, at any given time. They dropped that. And also the hundreds of years for it to recharge thing. They... 
they may not have dropped it because in like Borderlands 2, it was they were charging the key using a siren as the funnel to charge the key. So it may be that it still won't naturally open for hundreds of years, but you can charge it with iridium, which isn't discovered till after the events on Elpis. Okay. Appears that there's more to be learned from the iridium weaponry and spaceships. You have no clue. I earned a million bucks. Oh, um, seriously? Huh. Um, what? I guess in total. That is amazing. You are amazing. This game is amazing. I love this game. This game's fun. It's it's a lot of fun. We'll be returning to this and several of the other games for DLC at some point. I don't know when. I do technically have the first episode of the Krieg DLC from BL3 recorded. Um, but I don't know when I'm gonna edit and upload it. For the time being, it's kind of a not really sure situation. Right now, I'm gonna end this episode, this series, actually, and sort of this franchise, besides the prequel. My main problem with the prequel, apparent, it's just, I don't know, it's a good game in a lot of ways, but I, from what I've heard, there seems to be a bit of dislike around it. I don't necessarily play games because, oh, a bunch of people like it, so they're gonna watch my videos, sort of thing. I, I don't play games that way, I just play. But, I do dislike playing games that have an excessive amount of dislike around them when I have a bunch of other games I want to play beforehand and DLCs I want to play beforehand. So it's just kind of an iffy thing for me, you know? But yeah, right now I'm gonna end this series off here. This has been a whole lot of fun. I love this. Can't wait to return for the DLC eventually. May Probably gonna return for Borderland 3 DLC first. And then come back to Borderlands, you know. Uh, but yeah, for right now, hope you all enjoyed. If you did, think about leaving a like, comment, subscribe. Maybe check out the playlist in the description or on the end screen if you want to watch the rest of the series. See if you missed an episode, just or just rewatch it because you like it. You know, whatever. All that good stuff. Other than that, hope you all enjoyed. If you did, be good, be well, and I'll see all of you in the next one. Goodbye. You just couldn't let me do my outro without interrupting me, could you, Lilith?